How's it going, amazing people? Ever air game again? Another it's an episode more. Pretty P Showtime on V Nintendo Switch. Welcome to it. So last time, because uh, we took underneath V on the Sea, which is V on the Stay called Melody of the Sea, in my opinion, because we we have a uh, much of fun of that. Because it uh, turns out that we we dress up at Mermaid P, so that we go and sing with the fishes. I mean, she does have that amazing tune of her, the sound of her, her own voice. I mean, just the love and the fact of how she she did such a good job on concert of just playing. Be um be the song of her own voice. I mean, kind of give me a little mermaid vibe, like from the this uh, Disney movie from it. I mean, just to want uh, to imagine that the Pretty Peach is uh, Ariel from uh, from the Little Mermaid, and I mean, just to play on her as a as a mermaid. I mean, it was uh, quite fun to to play as her as a as her uh, mermaid ability to go and sing with the fishes. So, uh, and we uh, go and look at the menu, menu real quick. So, we go check in with wardrobe. So, um, there is uh, something else that we did a lot. So, we get here is the, the mermaid dress, which is brand new to us. So, we're going to put that on. Lovely. Okay, so, um, I not to get to the check in with collection. So, if we go to assembles. So, uh, I want to see what happens if we put on this uh, mermaid peach on. So, uh, if we press A. So, do that mean we equip it already? Okay, so I think we we don't put on the, the uniform that we got on these stages. Okay, so, yeah, well, let's go ahead and check in with the, the main menu again. So, I think we were supposed to look at album. So, let's look at the album real quick. Alright, so we keep scrolling, keep scrolling some more. Okay, so there's, here is a, a picture of Mermaid Pete performing on concert. With her melody voice. Alright, so that was it. Alright, so we're done looking at the collection. So let's get to move on. So we are now about to to enter to the boss lair is what I meant to say. Alright, let's have blast open this door with the power sparkle. Can you give me some of the sparkle gems that you collected? Give Stella 20 sparkle gems. Why, yeah, of course. So uh, I'll go give you 20. So uh, that go and spent it more. So we, we, we have 81 to go down to spent. Okay, so Stella go do all her sparkler, sparkle power to go open the, the boss door. Okay, so this is it. So we are now entering to, to the fur boss. Okay, so whatever fur boss we're about to encounter, let's uh, wait and see and find out. Well, fans are getting interesting, so if you guys are hyped for this uh, fur boss, just to make sure you hit up that advertiser like. Yo, what the? What is this? Alice in Wonderland? That creepy old cat from Alice in Wonderland? What the heck? Yo, Peach, Della, look out. Meow, or me over Peach and Stella I heard about? I mean, barely bits are part of matter greater esteem of production. Try as much as you like, Mew won't succeed. I suppose if Mew thinker you could defeat someone as grand as me, the guardian of this dark door. I'll swipe those smug as aspiration right off your little faces. Okay, well... We'll see who's talking. So this here is Projector. The Projector Cat. Well, the inventor of the cave. Well, let's just go and take out this cat right now. So what we got? Some mice coming right out of the hole. And what are we supposed to do with it? So we're supposed to pick it up. Okay, let, well, let's jump away from it. Um, what are we supposed to do with the bomb? Oh, yo, watch out, Peach. Okay, what the heck is going on? So we just turned the mice into sparkle, and it, uh, not spark, not just sparkle, the bomb. So we were supposed to attack the the hands. I uh, no, keep going. Don't get yourself bumped. Okay, right there, perfectly fine, I guess. Okay, so now I turn everything back to normal. So let's go sparkle the mice and turn it to a bomb. 
Well, we're not turning to some bomb or anything like that. Okay, so would it not go near the hands? What is going on here? Oh, oh, I see what's going on. Okay, so you got a phantom ball in, in its mouth. Now I see the problem. Okay, well, let's go again. And this time I'll, I'll go and stop you with your bear paws. Okay, so we want to time this right. So that gotta go through your mouth. Alright, there we go. That, that, that wasn't too hard. Okay, so we turned the phantom ball blue. Yeah, so we turned that bit blue of that sparkle there. So we get one of his heart. Okay, now you guys second phase coming out, which is gonna get a little tougher. Okay, that's not good. What the? Okay, well, glad I'm not losing that much heart. Okay, just go ahead and swap me with uh, whatever that is. Okay, so now I got paws. Alright, take your best shot. No, 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 don't swap. Bad kitty. Why would you do that? Okay, so we want that to, to go up to your mouth. Yeah, you're gonna eat bomb one way or another. Okay, do it. Just do it. Yeah, there we go. Good kitty. Alright, so that's the, uh, the second of his weak point taken out. So we get 20 Sparkle Gems. And I'm pretty sure his last phase is, is coming up smoothly. Okay, so now he's going to the paw slam me. Which I'm not ready for. Okay, so we can remove his paws. It's the part of his hands. And he got a second one coming. Okay, so hold on. No, no, no. Stop it. Stop it. Don't sweat the bomb. Nope. Get, get back. So we're going to leave the bomb there. Uh, no. N not my best style I need. Thank you. Oh, uh, hold on. Yeah, I don't know what that is. But it looks to me like some tail you're using. Okay, that's it, right? You're, you're done? Okay, now you're gonna go for that Phantom Paw Slam. Or whatsoever it's called. Well, whatever you call it, I mean, that's, that's the part of how I say it. Okay, so uh, that was it. So that was his uh, third and final weakness. Okay, so the uh, projector. Uh, I'm gonna yeah. So I think the um the third boss will name the uh, projector cat. If that's how I I describe it that way, because that is what cats you to the sound like when they say meow. Like uh, I know you we um. I I know uh, for for some reason. I mean, seeing a, a cat so terrifying. Kinda like give you nightmares. Well, that enemy was something else, huh? At least if it flows are back to normal now too. You perform it in a lot of different places now, so I'm sure it will be fine no matter what comes our way. Okay, what's happening? Yo, okay. So wait, so does that mean we get to to go up to the lift? So we get to take the elevator? That's where the theater started, but I wonder if the friends in the in that door were somehow keeping it from working. Oh, maybe it's uh, accessible again because we weaken and grape the magic by restoring the lower floors. Now we can uh, go to the basement and other floors and more quickly. Do you want to try it out? Mm -hmm. I mean, why sure thing? Yeah, let's let's try it out right now. So our first time around, we go use this uh, starlet like some elevator. Like, Luigi can take the elevator from, um, from Luigi Mansion 3. Now Peach can take the starter lift. So, uh, we can take our way back to the, uh, first floor if you like. Yeah, because I kind of love him. Because it's interesting that Nintendo can actually go ahead and, and do the, uh, the same like they did from Luigi Mansion 3. Like, uh, Luigi can, can go to the elevator and now Peach can take the starter lift. Like, it, it is like some elevator in my opinion. 
But yeah, I mean, it's, it's fun actually. So we can use the star limb any anytime we want. Now, check it in at the, 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 the dress up market real quick. Alright, so we check it with Peach. So look to me because we did a lot of something. So we got here the special patisserie peach. The, the, not uh, just the uh, patisserie peach. So we got special patisserie dress for 300. Nice. So we'll go purchase that. And we got here it's the projector dress for 200. <laughs> Alright, so we go purchase that. Nice. But actually, you know what? I do want to equip this. But yeah, it looks quite suiting on Peach well. Which I, I, I kind of love the, uh, the detail of the of that dress there, there because it's just the way how Peach is having uh, way so much fun uh, dressing out like a patisserie at her own self. So now she get her own patisserie dress. Alright, so I'm uh, moving on up to the uh, fourth floor. So we go use the star lift. So we'll go up to the, the uh, fourth floor. The fourth floor, not just the first floor. Okay, so yeah, now the, the fourth floor is where we're going next, I'm assuming. Now, check it in, so take a look at the spot. So there's only one last of this, of this uh, new ability for Pritchard Peach, I'm assuming. So yeah, so she's going to, to dress up as Kung Fu. Alright, so what we got going on here? Okay, so we got the one for Ninja, we got the one for... For what's it called? The the dashing the dashing feet peach. Yeah, that's the one. And yeah, so we got here is three other options to choose from, and we got more for Detective Peach. Okay, so um, if we go and look at wardrobe again, so what we got? Okay, so those were the two we did a lot. So we got here the projector dress and the, the special patisserie dress. All right, so look at that collection again. Yeah, well, look to me because we're down to I think we're down to to the last two. I think we need we do need to get the the, the second for for the kung fu and the the last and finale of the the dress up. I mean, not quite sure what it's called, but um um no um I'm positive we are about to reveal the on um, the last of this. I mean, like, how many dress up there are? So, I'm counting 12, was it? Okay, so there's only 12 of the uh, the, the dress ups ability that we, we had to, to get knocking out. So, we're only down to two more. Alright, so let's go ahead and check it with some tunes. Okay, so, um, what, what kind of music do we unlock today? Alright, so we keep on scrolling. Alright, so we keep scrolling some more. Okay, wait, was that it? Okay, so we, we already did got the Darko, the Darko battle. Alright, well, look to me because uh, that was about it. Okay, well, I don't see any exclamation mark icon that are shown through any of these music. So yeah, so I think we're all done now. So I believe next time on Pretty Peach Showtime. So we'll probably do more for Ninja P. So yeah, we're now pretty sure that the, we, we we got here is eight of these sparkle games that we we had to get searching to find, and one of this uh, metal which we which we do need to get right after. So I believe in that time we'll, we'll probably stick around by doing more of this uh, ninjutsu, but the one called the Art of Flames. So uh, that's something we can pick this up more later on the next series, you guys. So you don't go anywhere and you will be able to pick and stay tuned on the next series. So thank you guys so much for taking the time to tune in and watch this episode. So if you're joining this series and you want to see more of Pretty Peace Showtime, be sure to leave an advertisement, like, share the video, and subscribe. If you do subscribe, ring that notification bell so that you can stay up there and notified to one of, one of my newest and awesome videos on the way. So that's going to be all it for Pretty Peace Showtime. We'll be picking up more on the next one. So take care, guys. I hope to talk to you on the next video.